All right, guys, DSD's back. Uh, we're gonna introduce a new segment called Your Daily Dosage. Basically, what it's gonna be about is just some random hot sports topic that came up during that day. The question we bring up today is, was Matt Bosher illegally uh, drug tested after laying an absolute boom down? Stay tuned to listen. Yeah, so the NFL has been notorious for this. There's been so many instances where they absolutely screw, you know, with players. Um, you know, Eric Reed famously was out for the, you know, the NFL for three years, and he came back this year and he got drug tested seven different times during a 11 week period. That's not that. There's no way that that's random. You know, it's just it's just absolute bullshit. Let the man have fun. Matt Bosch is laying absolute lumber down. You talk about form tackle. Lower your hips, lower your hips, drive through the player, right? Near foot, near shoulder. Go ahead, give it a listen. <laughs> Having a great time. The Atlanta Falcons absolutely suck. Let them have a good time. If he's taking steroids, who cares? It's the best part of the game. We want big hits. Big home runs, we're talking baseball, we want home runs, more steroids, please. Really what it comes down to is that the NFL is just a no fun league. In 2013, Pat McAfee absolutely laid down an absolute bomb of a hit and was randomly selected for a drug test the next day. Seems a little interesting to me. Also, Pat McAfee, he tweeted two times about a 420 and the NFL just uh, gave him a drug test the next day. I mean, like, no fun league, let the boys play. Matt Bosher, keep doing your thing, bro. Lay your pipe down, drop the bombs. We appreciate you, keep doing your thing. DSD for life. <laughs>